What's up guys? Welcome back to the Stomping Grounds. I'm Trevor. Jared's behind the camera. Today we're doing a little bit of work to our hunting blind. We uh, started this project a long time ago, got it where we could hunt out of it and haven't done a whole lot to it since. So before deer season gets here, we're going to try and spruce it up a little bit with a few little projects. Today we're working on carpet on our shooting platform. If you look up here, we've got about a 10 foot sidewall and if you're standing on the floor you wouldn't be able to see out of the windows so what we did was make a little platform to get some extra elevation and we also have storage underneath but we're going to get some carpet on it today make it a little quieter softer on our feet you knock stuff over it doesn't make as much sound so stick with it we'll get her done well this is inside our bougie little hunting cabin we're 12 foot off the ground this platform puts you about 14, 15 foot off the ground. But what we're doing, we're just going to get some carpet on this and then take it up the walls a little bit. decide how we're going to trim this out yet. We still got to build steps. Just going to leave it hanging loose for now. So just to give you guys a little recap, if you haven't seen this place before, what all we got left to do, that's considerable. We've got this entire wall left to put plywood on. We're still thinking about putting a window right here. We're going to finish that gable. Then this is our little kitchenette area. We're gonna build shelves underneath. Might put a sink in it. All this is gonna be shelves. Put shelves up here. We're gonna put big doors on these storage compartments. And then we still need little shelves around the windows and stuff for all your little hunting doodads. Calls, bottles of piss, that kind of stuff. Well, we just finished the walls. Mostly, we still got to trim it out along that top. We got some cedar trim to go in there. We're uh, building some steps. And it doesn't sound like you're falling down a flight of metal stairs when you're getting down. Well, that's all we got for today on this project. We gotta get a few more materials. We gotta get some more plywood to finish this wall out. And we still gotta trim this. We're gonna use some of this inch and a half cedar trim and kind of box this whole thing in. That way we can get rid of all this excess. Plus, when you're rolling around up here in a rolly chair, It'll give you a little bit of an edge to keep you from rolling off the back. Um, our next project project's going to be shelving because we've got crap laying everywhere. All kinds of hunting stuff and tools and random stuff. So we're going to get some shelves, probably do some painting. But we're on the home stretch. I mean, it's fully huntable. Hopefully we can get one out of it this year. Definitely going to shoot some does. And then the last big project we have is putting a window in. 
we don't all we have on this side of the wall is this little one by one window you can't see a whole lot this way so we gotta rip this insulation out frame in a new window punch a hole through the metal reach through the hole trim the metal make it look like we intended to put a window there from the beginning i think we're going to put a house window in there instead of one of these blind windows so in case one day we get 110 ringing out here we can put an air conditioner in it hang out here in the summer have some cookouts and stuff this is kind of a deer camp we try not to spend much time out here because it's going to pressure the deer and screw her hunting up but it's such a cool space you can't not use it so thanks again for tuning in hit that like and subscribe and we'll see you on the next one mm -hmm.